All right, my first map. Get excited, you guys. It's really exciting stuff here. Yeah, I forged this so long ago. Awesome. All right, so that first uh, jump definitely could have been redone. Um, I actually did remaster this map. All the challenges, I assure you, are the same difficulty. Uh, I just made uh, getting to them easier, actually. And this first challenge, I love that first challenge. And everyone else is like, what? And I'm like, well, yeah, that's how you do it. And they're like, really? Show me. And then it's like, okay. Rewatch that section of the video. Anyway, some more thin stuff. Love this. Wedge to fill the space. Alright. Now jump to this fall away floor. Awesome. Alright, now this is one of the things that I definitely redid because it was, dare I say, a little sketchy all right it was pretty freaking sketchy i mean floating that stuff like you can't you can't deny that it wasn't easy but i could have definitely done it better and i don't know why i didn't but um i definitely did you know remaster it so it is done now uh just at the point when this video was made it was not so just disclaimer i guess all right so this is another thing i redid but you know it, it's pretty much the same. I mean, there's definitely a trick to doing that last challenge. It is not as easy as I made it look. But, um, you know, if you do it often enough, you, uh, you might get it. And <laughs> watch this video enough, I guess. So, the, uh, labyrinth up to the next two challenges that deal with this kill ball here. That are also not as easy as I make them look. That is kind of a lot to them, too. I mean, you really have to, you know, straighten yourself out and go exactly parallel with that first one to not, you know, get into Kill Ball's kill radius. And now, you have to go at that exact angle. I'm not kidding, exact. You get it, like, a degree or a few degrees off, and you are, like, cooked. Toast. I love this event. Look at that super smooth, ooh, roll cage. Love this challenge. And maybe this is another one where people are like, oh, that's so unfair, what the heck? You know, if you do this, you might die like, you know, 20 times, but there definitely is a trick to it. I mean, I will say at least one trick to it. Uh, but yeah, and that is the end. And you know, Tello, so you definitely cannot get to the end uh, without being in a mongoose. So uh, yeah, I did all mine on Sandbox, uh, just because I really love mid Sandbox. I mean, it's just so open. You know, this one is on the top of the map. Just so much space to work with and stuff. And, oh, that's great. Oh yeah, and that area I'm uh, kind of aiming at at the top of there is a secret finish. You know, if you, on that, uh, I don't want to say like, grind challenge, but if you get on top of that, which I actually have in trying it, then you can go in there. Okay, so this one starts on the outside of the, um, upper portion of the map. There's, uh, things called- oh yeah, here I, I don't think you might see the, uh, names of these. So that one, that first one is DJG Racing, uh, standing for my name, friends' names, who, you know, helped. I actually kind of recruited, but um, anyways, oh, I love that with the, the, uh, curve, you know, angling it to where it makes it easier to, uh, traverse. And that one, which, you know, I, I tried, I might have fixed that one, I don't know. I mean, these man cannons are just hard to get consistent results. They really are. I mean, anyways. So, yeah, and this one is called Derail, just because, I don't know, I mean, I kind of thought of, like, I don't want to say a train, you know, because I don't know where that would fit in. Oh, I love that flip there. I don't know where a train would fit in, but I, I don't know, I just thought of that, that theme, just derail. I mean, I know most artistic, like, naming shit like that is bullshit, but not this one. No, I, I really thought about that name here, and I, I think I just named it for the map. You know, I didn't necessarily make the map around the name, I made the name to the map. So, you know, I mean, it really fits. So that challenge I just did was super, super hard. I mean, like, 
she, I can barely do it myself, and I made it. So, uh, yeah, I mean, like, all of these things are play-tested thoroughly. I know for a fact that all of it is possible, you know, other than these videos that are on my file share with these maps, by the way, you know, alongside them. Um, you know, along with that, I playtest them, so they are definitely very doable. And all the challenges, you know, I mean, they are not easy, but they are doable. So, next time, if you're doing this, just thinking, oh, darn, I'm just gonna give up, this is impossible. Just watch this again. Maybe, you know, watch the, uh, specific challenge that you're stuck on. You know, get some pointers. Straight from me. Alright, so this one, now, these things, and this just driving physics kind of in Halo 3 in general, it's definitely different from Reach, and I love it. I love sort of the, uh, the 3 and Reach driving physics, mainly 3. Um... And it's just kind of hard to get uh, enough momentum in those things. And another roll gauge. I really roll there, too. And I just find my way out of it. Heck yeah. And that's one of those common themes in my map. A roll cage. I believe I might might have put it in the other one, the third one I made. I forgot. It's uh, coming up right after this one. But I love roll cages. And it's just that really unique challenge. I mean, they all are. But, ooh, this one really got to get just that speed getting up there oh now I did not think I would do it with that but I did all right now this one you guys are gonna love this one so, so, look at that. see what just happened there yep now I don't know if you know quite what this is yet this challenge but um see it'll it'll respawn yeah it'll respawn. yep there they are Heck, it's a maze, you guys. It's a maze. It's an exploding maze. So you have to traverse it in the fastest time that you can before those fusion coils spawn. And that one way up there spawns and detonates them all. So that's just like... I think I had the most fun making that of just about all the challenges. And that other one, that last like uh, curve, that like angled curve, is one of the hardest things to do. Like, I don't know, one of my hardest challenges, too. And that's why I just love making and doing these maps. Just the difficulty and the satisfaction of these challenges. So all those Tellos, and finally the end of this map. I'm looking around. Yeah, I made all that. Yeah, I did all that all in a row which is not easy I mean you know as I've said before each individual challenge is one thing but um all of them in a row oh yeah so I was playing with my friend uh, and my friend was all the way on the other side of the map literally just about as far as you can go and he's, he's way over there I'm just tr trying to snipe him and you will see why I saved this video, why I put this in here, uh, in just a few seconds. But yeah, he, and you know, during all of this time, he was just stuck over there, poor him. Uh, he couldn't even get past the first few challenges. So he was just stuck over there, and I just completed the course, and I was just trying to snipe him. So yeah, watch this, you guys. I, I killed him from across the map. I can't even really see him. I just see his tag. Watch this, watch Damn! Sniped him, moving target from across the map, people. Dare I say that is one of my best achievements in Halo ever. Like, <laughs> that right there. Okay, so another one. My third map. Challenge 55. Five is my favorite number, and I figure why not use it to name this map. So, yeah, um, starts outside of the map, that super awesome fall challenge. You gotta get that almost exactly right, fall into that box. Just that, like, one box. Tell the leading up to there. Oh, look at all these lifts. Perfect. Just getting down there. Floor it, Chief. Right into the hangar. Yeah. Now, this map was actually inspired by just a lot of specific things. Like, you know, that, by final mission of this game's campaign. 
um, you know, I can't necessarily speak for the section right here, except as another maze, which is pretty cool, dare I say. So this one, you have to get a lot of speed going out that ramp. And this, this is really, like, way more difficult than I made it look, just because you have to get, you have to hit it just right and with just the right amount of speed, too. You go at that with not as much speed, then you, you just can't get up that final, uh, ramp. You just can't do it. The wheels don't grip that way. So this one, really great. You just, uh, slide down there. Now this was inspired by Super Monkey Ball 2. That, uh, free fall level, actually. So free fall do an almost complete rotation, land right in that, uh, golf ball hole. I'm not done yet. The final challenge. This. Now you land right there. Get off. Right into that tello. Can't mess around. And that is my third map. Challenge 55. Complete. In all its good. Now I really want to know what you guys have to say about this. And you know, I mean, how you fair in my maps, these three that I have put so much time, effort, and love into. I mean, I do love these maps. I love making these maps. I love doing these maps. I just love everything about these maps. I love Forge in general. It's amazing. Because, I mean, I've got to, right? Like, this might have been one of my shorter maps, but it is not, like, it does not skimp on difficulty. Not one bit. Yeah, dare I say, all, all three of my maps are just about the same difficulty, which is very hard. And I really want to know, you know, how you guys do, you know, how many tries it takes you to do each one of these maps. So that is it for my maps. These three maps took a long time and a long time of play testing as well. But keep in mind, I had to test every single challenge thoroughly, you know, as I was creating them, as I was done creating them, doing them all in a row like I did takes a lot of time and is not easy. So please tell me what you think and try these maps out yourselves. That's all for now, guys. So I'll see you in the next video.